bit. All right, very early today, but I was feeling antsy and I didn't really have too much else urgent to do. So, ah, beautiful 160p. All right, we won't be potato quality today because I got, um, Mediacom was just fixing the crap last night and I guess it went into this morning. So it should all be good. All right, let me, oh wait. Let me post my social media garbage. Uh, let me make sure all this is working. What is that even? I've never used these Twitch posts things. Well, at least they, they changed them since I last used them. Streaming some Slime Rancher. I thought it would, oh no, shut up me. It does lead you to the stream, okay. That's, that's okay then. All right. I hate that this shows the connecting to chat thing. There's gotta be some way to hide that, right? Anyway, oh. This thing is slow. Muxibot, you are slow. Honey baby. There's something that only exists to share a stream. Anyway, we're gonna get started. This, this Twitch dashboard thing is huge. Oh, frick. Oh, I should have done borderless window. Oh, come on. I hate full screen games. This is so annoying. All right, we're back in. Okay. Wait, why am I not? Okay, there we go. Hey, son. Mm -hmm. Performance seems crappy. This This one game. Seems to have the worst issues with streaming. Well, how did you get out? I even lowered the graphics. How did you get out? Get, get your booty back in there. You freaking ingrates. I'm so sick of these guys' crap. All right. So I realized I've made a huge mistake with how I laid out my ranch, and it's gonna be a big pain in the butt to fix. Uh, so it's been a while since we uh, played some Slime Rancher. Um, there's some new features. One of them, the biggest thing is, well, not the biggest thing, but a big one is that if you have large amounts of money, you can just dump it into this 7Z Rewards Club and, um, it's an optional program, blah, blah, blah. Basically, it lets you get, um, some new cosmetic stuff. Um, and it gives you a few other things, like you get, uh, fancy, look at these fancy walls. Um, we can color the things. We also get these slime toys which we can buy, that basically just reduce agitation of slimes. Um, it adds this nice ranch thingy here. It's, uh, are these still going? Yeah, they are. So, Slime Rancher is nearly done. Um, it, uh, well, at least it's nearly at its release date anyway. I think it releases in August, and I think it's more or less content complete. Well, um, not quite. Because there are still some under construction signs left in the game. But um, I think all of the slimes that are going to be in the game are in fact in the game. What do you guys eat again? These guys, these these grassy boys are a problem. They, they were my first tar outbreak in a long freaking time. I was not, I was not happy about this. Uh, what do you guys eat? Oh right, this stuff, right? Ugh, these echoes are like cosmetics. They're kind of annoying. I need to put them somewhere though where I won't accidentally suck them up. Just bloop them out. These are like little cosmetic things you can suck up in the uh, ruins, which I'll show you later. We haven't seen the ruins on stream yet either. What these guys do is they can reach out of the corral with like little vine, creepy vine things. And then they eat stuff and plorts outside of the thing. So what happened was there was a little stray plort on the floor here. And they all turned into tar and they killed everything in that pen and this one. It was a horrible tragedy. I can't believe people are finding this stream more slowly than they found me just testing garbage last night. When I was playing a Bubsy game at like one freaking pixel per second bitrate. It was awful. Uh, what am I gonna do? Uh, I guess we're gonna go to the, uh, Glass Desert. That's the new area, the Glass Desert. It's the biggest new area. Um. Though one issue... 
I think I need to pop some Gordos or something. Hello. Because there's a slime key, a slime gate that I haven't been able to open yet. Oh, were you not a mod on Twitch already? That's fixable. Um, oh frick, it just completely dies and goes away when I do that. Oh wow, what? When I put, when I put the steam overlay, it just completely disappears. I hate full screen games so much. Anyway, how do I do the thing? Uh, which one of these is mod? That? Ah, there we go. Wow, Muxy is like five minutes late. Thanks, Muxy. Whatever. I see you lurkers, by the way. I see you. I see your lies. Uh, where was I going? Here. The problem is, I'm not sure if I can make any more progress in the glass desert alone. I can't find these mosaic slimes. We're gonna find them. But, I don't know where they is. I need them. I I found the other new slimes. The new slimes are, um... I like how this water? Question mark. It looks like flowing sand, almost. That or it is flowing sand. Um, so the weird thing about this place is that I only found one new species of, no, two new species of slime. They were just out in the open. Well, actually, no, just one was out in the open. The dervish slimes were out in the open. Hey, Binary and Unplugged. <laughs> yeah, the, the Twitch smiley is kind of weird. This is a dervish slime. They make little tornadoes. They're crazy. Uh, these are the only ones you'll find out in the open. Oh, here's the event that where you can find one of the other slimes. Uh, so there's also fire slimes now. And I don't know exactly what these things do. They seem to cause some of the tor fire tornadoes that happen. Spoilers, but there's there's fire tornadoes. Um, I can really see the, the decrease in quality. My, my graphics have suffered for the stream. Ah, oh, I need plorts, right. So there's some puzzles in this area. I think you need to fill... I think you need plorts from each of the new slimes. Ah, here we go. So this area has some dangerous events. Oh god. <laughs> it's right behind me. Um, has some dangerous events that have these, like, fire tornado things. And sometimes you can get a fire slime from their, like, remains. So I got a couple of fire slimes. They're basically like puddle slimes, but fire. I was hoping that ah there we go there we go these are the, these are the little spicy boys I don't know exactly what causes them to spawn other than it's obviously during the fire thing I don't know if you can encourage them to be spawned they just kind of happen and you got to suck them up real quick because they disappear um, as soon as the fire event is over wow a lot of spicy boys this time I just got like three of them my first try I'm not sure these are the ones you even need plorts from, which is good because I can't get their plorts right now. Um, at least not without going back to the ranch. But um, yeah, I definitely need some tangle slime plorts, which I can get, but I forgot to bring with me. But I also need mosaic slimes. You don't understand this game. It's just like, think Harvest Moon, but with much more exploration and much more slime. You're a rancher and you get these, you gotta explore to suck up all these little slimes and you bring them back to your ranch. And, um, with the money you get from farming the slimes, you get uh, stuff that helps you explore even further and so on. So this is kind of the final area. There's, there's these little, um, they've added a lot of, like, little improvements to kind of guide your way. Um... So like these little things, like, um, I don't know who they're from, but they're from like, I don't know, some older farmer. I didn't read all of them in order since I already played the game before they were added. But they kind of give you hints. They're basically the tutorial. Oh, here's some. So, I think this was a slime gate or something. And um, there was a big um, Gordo, which is the big fat slime of the Tangle slimes, which are the plant ones. 
and I had to feed it and pop it to get a bunch of Tangle Slimes. They don't seem to spawn naturally. Um, they only seem to come when you, um, when you pop a Gordo, which is weird. I've never seen, there hasn't, there haven't been slimes like that before now. Oh, you haven't played Harvest Moon? That's a crime. I'm sorry. It's so good. Um, I'm disappointed at Natsume. Natsume said they weren't going to bring like any of the old ones, the old Harvest Moon games to Steam or anything. Um... Like, hopefully they'll at least bring them to Switch, but Harvest Moon SNES is an extremely good game. Uh, the N64 one is good too. I think that, that was the best balance of complexity. So yeah, there's these mosaic slimes. I don't understand them though. I, they seem related to this place somehow, but I can't get them. I don't know what to do with them. Have a chicken. So, like, I found these weird... This thing seems related to them, right? I don't... But I don't get it. I bet I need water, which there... I don't think there is any water in this area, which is really annoying. So, I think... I wonder if that is the puzzle piece that I'm missing. Is it as addicting as Animal Crossing? Uh, well, when I first got this game, I got a key on Keymailer totally randomly. And, um, well, maybe I asked for it. I forget if I asked for it, but just one day out of the blue, I had it. And I just thought, hey, I'll check this out. It's early access, so I'm going to be skeptical and so on. But, you know, I'll play it for a little bit. I played it for the entire rest of the day. Um, it's a game you can really lose hours in really easily. Um, and I think I'm up to, let me see what my Steam stats are. 30, 38 hours total I've played. Which for me is a lot, especially for like a Steam game. Um, I don't, I don't tend to play most things more than like ten hours. So a mystery is afoot. I'm not really sure what to do about it. So there's new chickens here, painted hens. Which, those are for the Tangle Slimes, oddly enough. The Plant Slimes are, in fact, carnivores, which is creepy. Um, there's something I'm missing in this area still, because I haven't found the mosaics yet. Whoa. But unfortunately, I, I think maybe I need water. But I found another one of those weird fountain-looking things before, and I tried spraying it with water. It didn't work. Hello, Dervish. Um, oh yeah, and here's why I say it's not totally content complete, because there's still some under construction crap here. So there's going to be something over here, one of these years. Oh, and the moon is new! The moon is a giant slime. It's beautiful. Face value wouldn't think it'd be that deep, but these mechanics are really satisfying. Yeah, there's a lot going on. It, it sounds simple, which is good, I guess, but, uh... There's quite a lot to do. There's quite a lot of different slimes. There's like, there's at least 12. I forget exactly how many. There's a board um, back in the ranch that has a list of all of them. Hmm. Is the sun a slime? I'm not sure. Ow. Oh yeah, some of the slimes can hurt you. It's not really a combat game, but um, there are some dangers. I'll look directly at the sun next time we, we, we see it. How about that? Um, I like the feel of this place. It's very mysterious and a little bit creepy, but also very pretty. Never look directly at the giant fire slime. One problem with this area is I do get lost much more than I do with any other area. And this is probably because it's big and it doesn't have lots of landmarks. Whoa. Hello. Let's see, those are feral slimes. They'll attack you. Also, this creepy, like, cactus dudes. Like, I don't think they're actually alive or anything. What? Where did you... Huh? Those guys just, like, plooped out of nowhere. I don't know... I don't know what that was. Weird. 
Hey. I don't know where these guys are coming from. Oh, no! No! You have so much to live for! Rest in peace. Press F to pay respects. Um, ow. Oh yeah, another thing is that slimes can combine. So, even though there's only like, you know, 12 or so different kinds of slimes, um, every two kinds of slime, well, most most of the slimes can combine with other slimes, um, but only one other kind. Um, yeah, I am, I'm lost, so that's great. Um... it came from this way. Come here. I'm... Oh, you know what I should do? I think if I plant a Gordo trap... Wait, what's this? Must have been one heck of a scorcher that caused these glass formations. They always look like flames to me. Like a great firestorm covered this land before being frozen in time. And again, maybe these flames are burning away, but at a pace we can't even perceive. Perhaps the desert has two different times overlapping one another. And we're stuck in the middle of it. Wouldn't that just be wild? Yes, it would. Hey, Mr. Rosen. Um, so there's kind of some hints that the f the the uh, glass desert is like some alternate universe version of like the main area, I guess, is what it's suggesting. Please. Oh, no. I'm not, I'm not gonna, oh, yep, I made it, okay. Wait, what's this? I think this place is new. Maybe. Have I been here? Quantum slimes. I think these must activate if you fill up all of the, those statues that wanted, um, uh, plorts. Plorts are the little crystals that slimes poop out. So there must be two other dervish slime things, and then I can activate this. This is a puzzle. Hmm. What do you have to say? Quite a rare sight to guess the sand sea out there, now. I've scoured every corner of the desert, and everywhere I look, that sand sea stretches to the horizon. It makes me wonder just where the heck on the far, far range you are when the slime sea is nowhere to be found. So yeah, again, hinting that this is not, in fact, the same place. You have to admit, even though the quality isn't as good, there seems to be less chat delay on Twitch. The quality isn't that bad, is it? Um, I did have to reduce the game quality, so I'm, I'm playing in 720p. Um, but I... Oh, we got mail. Um... My bitrate is pretty decent, 3.5 megabits up. It's gotta be, ugh. I hate re waiting for this jetpack to recharge. I get why it's a feat, uh oh. Feature, but still. Wait, this is just down here. Ah, crap. So I think what I need to do is I need to, uh oh. I need to plant one of those carrot things in a gordo in a gordo trap. I think the quality is just twitch. Maybe. You're at 480p. Wait, do I have transcoding options? I thought you couldn't get transcoding options unless you were uh, above some ridiculous threshold or some crap. Or is that not true anymore? It's actually been a while since I was on Twitch, so there's some new features that are new and scary to me. Um. Like, Twitch lets you schedule events now, which I actually did. So a lot of people will be expecting the stream in a half hour, because that's when I said it was going to be. But, uh, I was impatient. Okay, this place kind of needs some landmarks, because I get so freaking lost in this place. Recharge, please. Uh, I want to say back this way is home. There were these guys, and then you go... Yeah, this is back home. Okay, it's so confusing. Um, I think there's some carrots around here. I'm not sure if they'll be grown yet. But silver carrots, I think, are the things that mosaic slimes eat. I can 
find them. Uh, they seem really rare, but you can grow more on the range. I just wasn't thinking about thinking about it. Uh, I think there were some around here, weren't they? Basically, transcoding means that you're as well. Are you the news news can still get it when there's server ability when you have a decent amount of concurrent viewers? Huh. I always figured that decent amount of concurrent viewers was like a hundred or something. Not like, what do we got, eight? Could be wrong though. Where? That or maybe there's just lots of server availability. It is like, you know, just plain old Tuesday. Um, hmm. Oh yeah, Star Mazer DSP is back on Steam. Um, Leonard just tweeted that out uh, like a couple minutes before I started the stream, actually. So that's cool news. My DMCA claim is still up on YouTube. I don't really want to talk about that, that whole nonsense, though. But uh, some good things are happening, at least. All right. This is not working out. Screw this. I'm just going to go back to the ranch. I do need to plant... I wish I didn't waste all these teleporters on places on the uh, that are kind of easier to get. It's a long way out to the... There we go. Um, what was I saying? It's a long way out to get to that place, so... I still have no... I think they removed it. I don't... I don't know if they're gonna bother to put it back in or what. I made this place so these assholes could roam free, because it's a huge pain in the butt. And they freaking hurt. Um, and it kind of works okay, because this place spawns lots of live chickens, so they just drop plorts all over the place, and it's kind of neat. Oh, speaking of plorts, thank you! I don't know if these guys get shy, like the, the fire, the water ones. Oops. Oh no! Friend. Ow. These guys are very spicy and painful. I don't know, they seem fine. Yeah, these guys seem to produce plorts even if you have a lot of them. Oh yeah, they added this new, um, to grow these guys, what you need to do. Oh, are they eating ashes too fast? Um, ah, I see how it works. Okay, so you need to build an incinerator and then you can build an ash trough now. And to feed them, you have to um, burn some stuff. So, and you can burn almost anything. You can just burn some random fruit. So they're very low maintenance slimes other than, oops. They're a little painful. And also other slimes that touch the incinerator will in fact die. So try not to murder other slimes. Unless it's what you're into. Ow. Collecting the plorts is a little bit hard. I don't think there's an option to auto-collect for these. Nah. But I'm glad that they, um... Ow. I'm glad that they at least, um... You don't have to... Like, with these puddle guys, you gotta... You gotta keep them to just a couple in a... In a pen, which is annoying. Hey, Mad Cap Cheetah. Oh, thanks. It's from Yoshi's Island. Well, sort of. The tap tap is. The Sir, I actually don't particularly care for the Sir. I just needed some way to make it unique within just a few characters. So I went with Sir and... Other than one person who stole the name on PSN, I've never had somebody take the name before me. There's one person out there that played, like, Kanan Lynch... So obviously they have good taste, right? And um, that's the only game they played. And they never used that account again. And I don't know if that was deliberate to like bite me, but uh, it seems very suspicious. Oh, thanks for the follow. Oh, I forgot I even had StreamJar set up, so I don't have... I got, uh, what's it called? Twitch alerts? Stream alerts? Stream labs? Something like that. Um, I just haven't set it up yet, and I don't have it showing on my stream. So I just keep my raw slimes here, and it works pretty well. Star slimes actually never starve, so you can just keep them in a big love pile like this, 
And uh, as long as they can't reach the top of the cage, it's fine. The Boom Slimes used to be a huge problem to contain, but they barely explode anymore. Um, they're pretty docile. Um, I don't know exactly what- they seem to have nerfed them like multiple times, because they're no longer a major problem. They used to be the worst. What other games? I play all kinds of different stuff. Um, Horizon Zero Dawn I've been playing. Um, I usually play different stuff almost every week. So, Prickle Pear. Ah, this is what I wanted. So, these are the silver parsnips. I guess they're not carrots, but whatever. Um, I think... Alright. How do I... I usually play this with a controller. I don't know why I'm using keyboard and mouse. Um, so, there's this Gordo snare. I don't know how it works. Special snare that captures a Gordo slime. Bait it with food and wait. I don't know if you need to be in the region of a slime to make that work properly, or how that works exactly. But just to be careful, I'm going to go into the glass desert again before I use it. Because what I want is a freaking mosaic slime. It's the last kind of slime I don't have. I'm going to find it. Hey, BP, by the way. No, you can always run this fast if you... You just have to, um... You have to have, like, energy. It's kind of like Half-Life, where running takes energy mysteriously. Um... To do these prickle pears. Uh, what eats these again? Actually, let me grab my dervish slimes. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna dump these in here. I don't care. Oh wait, even better! I can shove them in the feedery thingy. Where's the feedery thingy? I didn't buy it. Um, wait. Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, back to the far, or the glass desert, right after I do this. For some reason everything requires royal jelly, everything fun. So I figured I should just get some apiaries and get some more jelly. Like, I forget exactly what I wanted royal jelly for, but I know I wanted it. They look so happy when they have something for you. Only one royal jelly. Alright. Oh, and a great new feature is that you can get, um, a thing that links directly to the, uh, factory. So you don't have to go to the factory tent anymore to drop off items, which is so, so much better. Is this... Yes. Okay. So I need to go back here. And I want to place... A Gordo Snare. Thanks for the follow, Eric666. Freedom Planet. I do have that. I've, I barely started that. I'm not super great at Sonic. Novice Gordo Snare. I don't know how much time you have to wait for these. I don't... I assume it's not something that happens while you're watching. I assume I think you can use a Gordo Snare in any old place. Oh, really? Oh, that's cool. Like I said, I haven't really... dug too deep into any of the new features. I don't know if there's new... like, production materials for, uh... Right, I'm still in build mode. For this region, but um, I'm gonna plant some apiaries here. Uh... So I could just plant these around my own ranch and grow them, because that would be awesome. That would basically let me get almost any slime I want. That would be great, actually. Which is kind of a surprise, because I thought they were resisting 
Like, I asked him if they were ever going to make a way to make more slimes, and they said no. And this seems to be basically a way to just make more slimes. But, uh, whatever. I have 13 sevens. What? Oh, that's my level of, uh... This stupid thing. The, the rewards club thing. I don't know why it's 7z. But, um... Yeah, that's your new money sink. So... Uh, I don't know what mosaic slimes eat. But I was waiting to get mosaic slimes. Before I... Oops. Um, I was just planning to have a couple of super high value um, slimes in here. So that I could uh, rapidly get some money to get the rest of this stuff. Oh, how dare you, James. How dare you. Hey, James, by the way. If you use Gordo Snare in my game, you get to come back after like a day or so. I only try to dry reef pink, pink Gordos. Alright, I actually need to keep a couple of Tangle Ports, don't I? Oh, that's dangerous. So, well, not dangerous because like... But the thing with these jerk holes... Oops. I sent a food, not a plort. The thing with these jerk holes, if you leave a plort outside of their pen, they will take it in and eat it. And um, that can lead to murder. Very bad. I like Sonic games, they're just I'm not very good at them, and they get they can get pretty frustrating when you're not good at them. Actually, I think I only need like five of these to take along. Oh, Sonic CD is kind of a mess, frankly, level design wise. Yeah, I think I just need to take a nap. And uh, what's our star mail? Oh, yeah, this is this backstory now delivered through the mail system. So yeah, we have Casey as our friend or something. I don't know. I haven't really read them, frankly. I plan to start a new file when the game is completely released, but for now, I'm just keeping on with my uh, existing save file. Okay. We're going to bring all the silver parsnips we can, because I I don't know how much the Gordo is going to want to eat. I assume it's not this many. But uh, why not be paranoid, right? Also, I'm gonna want some dervish plorts, so let me just procure those real quick. Alright, this pen is very painful. The, the, the one thing that keeps you from like having a billion slimes, or that makes it difficult to have a lot of slimes in, is that certain slimes are very, very painful to be near. Oh god, how did you get out? Five is enough. I think I only need like four plorts. It's a little hard to get out just the slimes you want with my method there, but it saves me a lot of space. So I think for now that's just what I'm going for. Hey, Jolly Joltik. So let's just dump these boys in here. Everything is great except the level design. I mean, it's kind of a loaded statement though, isn't it? It's kind of like... What? No! How did you do- What the f- I hate Tangle Slime so much! What is your problem? What is your problem? Get- Fuck off. Fuck off. No. What happened? What the hell? Did- Where is it? Don't tell me they reached in the other pen and got it. Did they reach in the other pen? I hate Tangle, tangle Slimes. They're, they're worse than Hitler. What, 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 what is this nonsense? What? I can't believe this. There, there were no plorts on the floor. They got it from inside this pen. I hate you. I hate these things. Ah, <sighs> crap. Uh, whatever. What am I going to do with all these prickled pears? Let me feed something else. Favorite part of Generations? Probably Modern City Escape. Okay, I never did finish Generations. Um, what eats? Do you guys eat that? No. Hey, here you go, friends. The 
Okay, so tangled freaking slimes need to be kept way away from everything else. Gravity slime. No, they just, they're tangled slimes. They have like tentacles and they just reach out way further than I thought they did. Um, to grab plorts from other places. Oh, God damn it. Where'd you get food? Oh, right. I gave you food. No. No, you're not allowed to have food anymore. So these guys need a freaking special pen. I'll, I'll keep them somewhere else, I guess. Ugh. Loser jerks. Freaking annoying. All right. Let's go get that Gordo Snare. All I want from Sonic is to go fast. I don't know. Honestly, I really enjoyed um, Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 because I didn't really feel, like, lost and it didn't feel... I don't know. Yes! Mosaic Slime! Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, look at that shader! Oh. Now that is a slime. Beautiful. Alright, here you go, my friend. Remarkable from every angle. Oh, fuck off, box! Why don't they break when I... Okay. No. Look at the face they make! Also, I don't know why the money breaks out of the box. I always thought that meant that it may... It, it meant that you get money. You, you don't get money when that happens. I don't know what the deal is. It's just lies. Filthy lies. I don't think any of these are rare. Is that one rare? Oh yeah, that's the odd diamond, isn't it? That one's actually... That's actually a little rare. Let me poop those out. Strange diamond. Crap. I didn't want to have... Ugh! The, the... Hold on. Can I have a... Storage thing? The problem with this place is you need, like, I need better warp tech or something. Amber teleporter. Uh, not here, though. Ugh. It's so burdensome to only have four item slots out in this area. Especially since I need to bring these stupid, um, plorts all around me. From what I've read, you need to put your favorite food of what gore do you want to catch in the stair? 80 food is flavor food in half. Cuts food. I don't think it's 70 to 80. I think it's more like 50. Because, like, I only used, like, 20 parsnips. So that would be, like, 40. Or no, I used... How many did I use? 15? So that would only be 30. See, it seems to be fairly cheap. So, um... What do with you? hate these things. Um, I'm gonna turn this into a corral, I guess. Or, no, a corral, damn it. Corral, okay. And, oh wait. Let me get the walls, music box, air net, feed, everything with the solar shield. Oh wait, I can dump this off. Yeah, the, the, the crafting materials really make it easy to uh, run out of space. Oh, look how pretty! These are, these are the best slimes. Alright, so... Oh, they have the best plorts, too! These are my favorite slimes now. They're even better than the rad slimes. Sorry, rad. It's 33 of their favorite? I have way too many silver parsnips for that to be true, though. Oh, not rock slime. No, I need dervish. Are there dervish in here, too? I think I put a bunch in here. Okay. I usually go for about 20 in one pen. Oops. Oh, that's bad. Wait, what?
did he leave the pen or is he in the pen? He shouldn't have been able to leave. I think, oh no, he's, hold on. Come here, boy. Come here. There you go. I should put all the dangerous ones in one pen. Or maybe that's, maybe that's a bad idea. I guess the crystal slimes are still really pretty, but I don't know. I think the uh, the other ones, the mosaic slimes look a bit prettier. Why do those slimes have orbitals? They're dervish slimes. They make tornadoes and spin around like crazy. Do I have a refinery link? Um, yeah, I have it. Um, I have one here. I guess I should bring one to the glass desert at some point. All right, dervish slime. Here. All right, and I can feed you those these things. I'm surprised that these ones that there's only one carnivorous one. The carnivorous slimes are the most annoying to work with, so I figured all the late game ones would be uh, that. Oh, why do they go so high? Whoa. That might be a problem with the Skynet, but... Whoa! What are those? Did those hurt? No, they're just kind of sparkle. Huh. Alright, anyway. Uh, I have a thing for these, right? Looks like you can switch dimensions there until they slimes are in the other dimension. Uh, interestingly slime- hey! I think they have some growing pains, is all. No! There's certain slimes that are a lot easier to contain when they're Largos. Why did they- what, what was that explosion from? Do those explode? How did you get up here? Uh, the interestingly slimes, I guess, are in both dimensions, but it will- They're mostly in this dimension, actually, but- I guess it makes sense that you need the you need the plorts from the interdimensional slimes to get to the glass desert, which is hinted to be in another dimension. So that makes sense. Uh, where did I get this hunter slime for from? I got plorts all over the goddamn place now. That's actually really bad, because if another slime got to them, they could become a tar. All right, let me drop off this little. Let's just bring it with you, and then you got materials set down and bring it back. Yeah. I, I guess since it, that one get, you can just replace, right? So I guess I could just take it with me, can't I? Best slimes. I need to. Oh, I need to make these ones plus the crystal ones. All right, hold on. I think I can drop off these parsnips. Somewhere, right? Yeah, here we go. I think there's just enough. There's just um, enough space in two silos to hold one of each uh, plant-based food. I don't leave any slimes purely carnivorous because chickens are a huge pain in the butt to deal with. I think I need some tangle plorts as well, right? All right. So I think to find the final mystery in Glass Desert. We just need to, uh, I don't need a, that thing. We just need to uh, find all of the places where I need to put plorts. Yeah, hunter slimes are really cute. They're really hard to find though. Oh, I can place Gordo nets now though and get a bunch more of them though. That was actually why I asked uh, if there would ever be a way to get more slimes because the hunter slimes are really hard to get in like any number, but um, it would be, oh, right, I left a bunch here. Okay, so there was one up here, I think. I think there's only three of each slime thing. Come on, recharge. All right. That's a good idea with the refinery link. I just didn't wanna mess with it right now. 
Yeah, I didn't consider that. That's probably why you can't pick up the teleporters. Um, yeah, here's one. Did that? Did that light up like the whole area? That's weird. There's another one right around here. I don't know where the third one is of this, though. It feels like it must be in this area, right? Because the other two were. Hmm. Are you planning on sending up a Discord fans free of trolls? I do have a Discord. I thought you knew my Discord. Oh. Ooh! Spicy honey! Okay, you were right. Pepper jam. Okay, so there are new materials for this place. Okay, I should have picked up the the, the whatever link. You're right. Um, no, where could that last one be? I'm just gonna leave those for now. I think it's, I think we pretty much combed this area. Return the Discord screen sharing guide so I see a Discord. Yeah, I have a Discord. Just go to sirtaptap.com slash Discord. That brings you to a link to it. Ah, here we go. That, did that do it or was there, is there another one? I don't think this one, nah. It would make a bit more sense for there to be four than there to be three, right? But I don't see anything anywhere else that would be here. You put a rooster in the snare to get a hunter, Gordo. Oh, cool. I'll have to do that soon. Those snares are... Those snares sound seem really cool, then. I could fill my... I was planning to have, like, a nice zoo where I have a bunch of the normal um, slimes of every kind... And that'll be a lot easier with the Gordo snares. I'd always kind of figured that the Gordos, or the, uh... Hunter slimes would just always be too rare for that. Which is a shame, because they're super cute. Now chat, Hunter slimes or Tabby slimes? Which do you prefer? Hmm. Can I get up there? Seems possible. There you go. Oh! What's this hungry boy? Um. I see. I bet he has a slime key. Uh, crap. I'll, I'll come back for that. I'll come back for that. First, I want to get rid of these plorts so I don't have to carry them around because this is... The pain. I forgot what tabby slimes look like. They just look like little tabby cats. They look very much like hunters, really. Because, I mean, they're both cat-based. Ah! Wait, what the hell? What is that, a crystal one? A rock one? Ah, oh, there's so many things that need the things. Okay. Does anyone know if those are rock or crystal ones? At least they're all in one area. Huh. This is some complicated crap. Ah, oh, slime key. Alright, we had to come back for that anyway. So whatever. Hmm. I don't think there were any around here, were they? Hunter Phosphor. They're rock. Okay. That makes more sense because there there was a rock slime around here. Ah, here we go. So I think all of the mosaic ones are here. Wait, 
Wait, so are there three of each, or are there four of each of these things? Ah, uh, no. Stupid thing. <laughs> it's pretty when the, uh, the desert goes all murder form. Oh, I gotta stop running. I hate that running and the jetpack are the same fuel. I just want to be able to go fast! I also like the music when it does this. Nice western theme. Hello. Alright. Alright. Get up. Come on. Ah, oh, what the heck? How did I get up here before? I had no trouble getting up. Ah, that's how. Ow. Ah, oh, please. I don't need no, any more spicy boys right now. <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. Oh, they make boulders too. Okay, here we go. this? Ancient water. Ancient water. What is ancient water for? I have some ancient water plants. What does it do? You only get a few minutes, uh, like half a minute of it. What am I supposed to do with this crap within 20 seconds? Oh! That's what I'm supposed to do, apparently. Hello! Hi, friends! Uh, let me suck up the- oh. I see. Okay, that's where you can get mosaic slimes without, uh... Wait, no, you still had to use a Gordo, because you couldn't do this without mosaic slimes. But... Wait, what's this? There's an energy field around it, okay. Huh. That's neat. So I guess you're supposed to, like, rejuvenate the, uh, the desert. So I... I bet there's another one of those, then, that requires some other things. Alright, so where's another... O Oasis Buds? Huh. I guess that's what that is. So... How do I carry this crap to another one? It seems... Oh dang, it fully fills your water, too. That's a nice touch. All right, gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. I think there's another one this way that we can reach if we're real quick. No? I think there's... Oh, I thought there was... Yes, 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 yes! All right. We got two, at least. I don't know how we're gonna reach some of those other ones, though. Oh, lots of Tangle Slimes here. Let me suck up these Tangle Slimes, and... I'm gonna take these puppies back to base, and then we're gonna try to solve the mystery of the rock one, and... Uh, get the slime key from that Gordo. At least I hope it's a slime key. I don't know what else it would be. Huh. So that's neat. Um, what else we got going on? So I think... 
I think I'm done with the plorts for those three. Because I think I already did the dervish ones, so that's why I only had to do those two. Fountains that give you ancient water and that can be unlocked if you have plorts three times. Rock fountain is near the main area where the Gordo is. Yeah, I remember seeing the Gordo. Oh, are you kidding? Taurus can form in here? Oh, wait. I think this thing kills the gor the tar, so that's extra cool. Oh, hello, friend. Come here. So that's why this area was so barren of... When you first come in here, there's not many slimes around, which makes sense because it's a desert. Then I guess you, uh, you gotta refill it with life. With the mystic water, whatever it's called. I don't have food. I'll just get plorts at home. I think they just take a bite out of you when you walk past them. Rude. Alright. Pepper Jam can go in here. Uh, Dervish Plorts can go in there too, I guess. Alright, Mosaic Slime. I don't need this. Why did I get this? I guess I do want that because I do want I want that to be in the right place. Um, let's just jump dump these boys in here. Tangle slimes are already in here. Man, I gotta make some crystal uh, mosaics because that's gonna be beautiful. I think I've got some rock plorts here. Do I need any other kind of plorts? Does anybody know? Thanks for the follow, Hector. Uh, rock fountains do the main. Oh yeah, I know that part. Um, let's drop these off. All right, any new blueprints? Lots of new blueprints. So blue teleporter, gray teleporter. All right, I think I need. What do I need for the teleporters? I think that's why I was farming for more um, magical crap. Jelly. Oh, that's the strange diamond you need for that. Oh, royal jelly is what you need for a refinery link. <gasps> oh, there's a market link. Oh, heck yes. That, that actually solves a lot of problems. Okay, that's why I was going for those. Um, that solves my problem with this area. Because with this area, I have a ton of plorts here, but it's a little bit of a schlep to the, um... To the, uh... Back to the slime market. See, I can just... Oh, that is awesome! That is way better than the original stuff. Did, did the market link come... Is the market link new? Because I... I, I would have thought I would have noticed that before. That is very nice. Because yeah, I have all of these slimes here, and it's like, well, I have to suck up 50 plorts and bring them back over there. But no, this is way better. Yeah, I didn't notice if there was a, yet another update. I kind of figured that this was nearly content complete, like I was saying earlier. But uh, I'm happy with that. That is... <laughs> that and the refinery link are probably the two best items, other than maybe teleports. But the teleports are more... Uh, Expensive and hard to use. Alright, so we got some rock plorts. I think we just need like three. Oh, right, I can't put those back in. Whatever. Um, and I need the pears. I need prickly pears. Why are you on fire? Cease being on fire. What's your deal? Nobody told you to be on fire. I guess it's like the, the, the shininess of the crystal makes f f fire? I don't know. I'm not a scientist. I could have been a scientist though. I wanted to do, I wanted to be uh, like either biologist or geneticist, but it was a bit, it was too much study. There was too much of a study to work ratio. I, I just wanted to be able to do cool things right out of college instead of spending a billion years. 
How do I feed you again? That works. I just want these out of my inventory, honestly. Uh, silver parsnip, I think I still need more stock for. I'll take these prickle pears with me. In fact, I'll take a few more for safety. I think 60 should be good. Um, yeah, that should be good. Anybody know if I need any other plorts? I should probably... Wait, I have another teleporter, so I just... I think I'll plant a teleporter somewhere deeper in here. Oops. Oh, hey, we, we went in right into a heat wave. They're supposed to be dangerous, but they're actually just really cool, honestly. They don't really... Nothing in the game is supposed to be, like, really painfully difficult to deal with. Um, other than Tangle Slimes, apparently. It's just kind of neat. Which I, I like better anyway, but... Can you send me the link to the channel through PM? Right, it's not too much of a secret. Just don't make me ban you. That's my one rule. Don't get banned. Most people have managed to follow that rule. Um, how do I make a... Create a scene invite. Hidden use copy button. There. That's a Discord invite. Um, but you can just go to sirtaptap.com slash Discord if you want to get in. It's open for now. If somebody decides to make me regret it, I, I will close the Discord. But until then... We will, we will try the grand experiment of being open. I haven't really had, we've had, I've only banned like two or three people. And only one of them was actually a rando. Two of them just happened to be bad people, unfortunately. It happens. Uh-oh. Okay, I don't think you're actually supposed to be, get up, be able to get up here from here, but I did it last time, so I'm going to do it this time. I'm a speedrunner. What'd they do? Ah, eh, it's bleh. Just don't be a dick and you won't get banned. It's not really something you need to worry about. Alright. Here you go. Alright, so I think I had 31, right? So for favorite food, you need... You only need 25 of the favorite food. Ah, yes! I figured it'd be that, because I need one. I need these. No, none of those are rare. Alright. Let's just go... Figure out what's going on with this rock plort area. Hey, Dan. Um, I think they were right. Yep. Which reminds me, there's a whole area with um, some of these other slime like crystal holders that... Um, we haven't seen on stream, because I played that pretty much off stream, I think. Uh, the whole... I don't even remember what that area is called, because I thought it was going to be the Glass Desert. There's this big door that you open, and you open these new ruins, and I thought the Glass Desert was going to be there. But... Not quite. Did that do something already, or... <gasps> yes, it did! Okay, what's this? The desert is a harsh place for sure, but there are little pockets like this. Oh yeah, I read this before, but I didn't know what it meant. Use that noggin, Beatrix! See, this one's much easier to unlock. Oops, that's a plort. I don't need these plorts. Get out of here. Alright, ancient water. Never mind, I guess I do need those plorts. Alright. Where? Ah! Alright, what have you got for me? So do these pockets stay open forever then? I guess I'll take the mosaics. <laughs> Why are you on fire? Cease being on fire. I just hate when people just be on fire without permission. It's very rude. I mean, being on fire is just unfortunate for everyone around you. Please, please be considerate before you be on fire. I know it sounds tempting, but... You just gotta think of people other than yourself. 
I'm so glad that fills your water fully because it's been such a pain to keep a large amount of water in this game. I never have water when I need it, especially because you lose all your water when you die and I usually forget. Ah, yes. I usually forget to um, stock up. Is there just two here? I guess so. <laughs> I like these oases. This is a really cool idea. They seem to erase the... There's so many slimes, it's like inevitable they're going to make tars, but it seems like they destroy tars as well. <laughs> this is really cool. Tap Tap is a professional fa face fire setter. Please set faces on fire. Well, be having your face set on fire is very different from setting yourself on fire. Let's see. I determine who gets set on fire. That's just that just makes it easier for everyone. I have not heard anybody complain about this who has not subsequently had their face set on fire for mysterious reasons. So obviously it's just it's working. All right, we're going to open the door. We're going to open the door. Where's the door? We're not going to open the door in time, are we? Oh, maybe. There's still some there's still some uh, oasis things that I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get to in time. Not with this animation. Hmm. So this is a new area. If you think they look bad, just keep practicing. Just nice All right. Let's I, I actually used to draw in way back in high school. Oh, crap. I honestly, I don't think I was that bad either, considering I, I took like a couple of drawing classes, like, um, and, um, like not even like full-time like school classes, like, like tutoring things. And, um, I, I did fan art of a webcomic, honestly. That was, I was such a cringy teen, but, um, I don't think it was that terrible considering incredible lack of practice, but, um, I don't think I could do that now. I, it would be a lot of practice, and I just... I have too many hobbies already that all my hobbies are either expensive or take a lot of time, so... Adding another hobby that takes as much time as drawing, I don't think I could really do that. It's, it's unfortunate. You don't really have time to do absolutely everything. I love how murderous the, uh, the Tangle Slimes are. I hate how annoying they are to contain due to their murderousness, but... They have gusto, and I appreciate that. My sister got all the talent for both art and writing in my family. Being able to actually get ideas down. This is a skill that eludes me. Yeah, the tar seem to happen, but they get eradicated, I guess. Zero dropped frames. That's nice to see. I, I'm not really sure what I'm looking for anymore. But yeah, I, last night's issues were just because Medicom was doing maintenance. I wish they had some way to alert you that that was happening. But alas, they don't. Is this just area I was at before? Or is this... Where is this? Hold on, I want to go back. I get so lost in this place. I came from here, right? So I came from here. I actually did draw in way when I was tiny bab in like first grade, I did draw some like stick figure garbage. But I never really doodle even doodled much. Until I, I was on a brief art kick in in high school, and that kind of didn't last. I was also on a writing kick as well. Gold ports. Okay. Rest in pieces, Tangle Slimes. You are worth your lives were worth exactly one gold port each. Um, I hope you use this information wisely. Also, the game kind of implies ports. Uh, slimes don't really die when they hit the slime sea. They just kind of like merge into the existence of being 
in the sea itself and then just emerge later as slimes. Like, it's just a mass. Like, it's a slime sea. It's just like a mass of conjoined flesh. It's like a necromorph for slimes. Which probably now makes it sound worse than death, but it's it's fine. They're fine. Excuse me. Excuse me. Why was it latched, like, directly on my face? That was very rude. Alright, so there's another one of these. Alright, what's up here? It's your tap-tap experience. I have to see this. Hold on. I need to play this in full screen windowed. <laughs> this this is the Sir Tap Tap experience, friend. Oh fuck. Hold on. No. Here we go. <laughs> it's setting faces on fire. That's that's me from Borderlands. Well that's what I do in Borderlands anyway. I absolutely love the elemental stuff. I need to play this in full screen windowed so I don't like whenever I leave the window it just goes like blop and it's unpleasant. Uh, how do I get... I'm not sure I'm supposed to get up here now, but... That just makes me want to get up here even more. Oh crap, I didn't... So what's everyone's opinion on the, the chat display? I think it's kind of ugly, honestly, but I... I don't, know, I, I don't know a better way to get chat from Twitch. YouTube had a really nice style thing that I could do. Oh shit. What do these eat? Oh right, it was parsnips. Oh, there's a cave! Oh no! Please! Oh, hello. Alright, so there's a cave in there. I really want to get in there. What's this? Oh. So there's oasis buds. So obviously there's gotta be... A fountain around here somewhere. There's things that literally the chat is transparent. Oh yeah, here we go. We're we're back here. Is there maybe another fountain around here? I forget what this thing's called. It's called Cap Chat or Kappa Chat or something like that. Oops, that's death. Um. But um. There's this, there's this much better one called like 1080, something, somebody's 1080p chat. And it looks a lot nicer, but the chat auto fades. So like the, the past messages are faded out. And it looks stupid. And I just want, I just want normal text. I want what I had on YouTube, but just for Twitch. What's it was Septopus for Twitch? We do have Mooksy. We have Mooksy is what will post um, the Twitch links in Discord. I did. There are Twitch links for Discord. Um, oh, oh, these work now. Oh, cool. So this didn't used to spawn mosaic slimes, but now that we've revived some of the desert, I guess it does. That's neat. It gives this place. There's a lot more like, not quite RPG, but there's more e exploration, I guess you'd say, aspect to this area, which is really cool. You didn't really unlock anything in the first areas. Um, where should I put a teleporter? What is my favorite slime? I guess mosaic slimes now. I really like crystal slimes and hunter slimes as well, and rad slimes. I like about half of the slimes significantly, and the other half are at least okay. You know what, I think this is, this is where the Gordo was anyway. So I think I'll put a teleporter. Uh, it'd be better in plain sight. Uh, I guess this is a good enough place as any. Wait a minute, do I? Amber teleporter, actually that's perfect. It's amber for the desert. Must have been one hack of a scorch. Oh no, we saw that before. Um, Unfortunately, I forgot to put the other half of it at the ranch. So. Mosaic Hunters? That'd be interesting. Oh, hello, friends. But what you had on YouTube before... 
support the full Twitch chat experience. Oh no, there would not be emojis or Twitch emotes, fortunately. But uh, I might be able to scavenge the, C the CSS it used and just apply it to Twitch. I just need to change the um, the classes and so on, probably. Then I need to find it again because I forget what it was called. But it was pretty easy to find, I think. Here we go. Now I can get back to home. And I have 3D Rage Face Streamer Chan faces, yes. And like 500 Cherno emotes. It seems to be instant success on Twitch. Have a Cherno emote. The subs will flow like fine wine. Which is weird because fine wine like flows in very small quantities so whatever I don't know where to best put my teleports because I kind of ran out of space I was trying to put them all up here around my house which seems like the most logical place but I ran out of space well I guess I got this I really wish you could replace where the teleporters go because they're really expensive and it I have many regrets Flow like Klingon wine. Hey, Gabe. Streamer chant. Oh, oh, yes, I do. I just did my best. Hank Hill shudder. Um. Hmm. What was I gonna do? All right. I guess I better. You eat these, you stupid. All right. I don't think they eat those. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Um. Whoa. Fire plorts are so cheap now. I guess I sold too many. Uh, let me dump these boys back in the, uh, the zoo. So many custom emotes and not one of a garbage bin. Oh, they have a picnic emote now. Of course they do. Wait, what? I excuse me? Why did you not go in the pen? I guess I hit... I guess they hit the other slimes. This is ridiculously pretty. They're a little bit low res, but I think it's because my graphics settings are kind of... They're on default since I get a little bit worse performance when streaming. OBS is using about 30% of my CPU right now. I can't wait for those AMD Ryzen or whatever things. I'll be able to have 16 threads. 8 cores, 16 threads, final destination. And I can just cram all of these guys in one pen now at this point. Th they look like Skittles. This looks... I want to eat them now. My fans are tapped at moment was he roasted the guy who wanted a Rage Gamer. Oh yeah. <laughs> that happens once in a while. There's this one guy who... Someone was really upset that I was not mad at a video game. They're like, wow, we get it. You like the game. You like video games. Why are you playing video games on YouTube then? You're supposed to hate video games! I don't- I don't understand the attitude. Like... I don't know. For, for a lot of people, it just seems that they got... Like, cynicism confused for authenticity. So you have to be... You know, you have to be incredibly harsh and just insult things. Otherwise, you're not sincere. I don't know. I guess I used to be a bit like that, too. Sorry, you won't find Rage Gamer hates game the shit posting in here. Oh yeah, that is what I said, isn't it? I try not to get too sassy, but sometimes the sass does happen. You do not want to know what Sir Tap Tap really feels. Oh, th th there's some people that are very lucky they have not gotten a full earful of tap tap irritation. So I tend to, both for, for their benefit and for my own, I tend to not respond to just people being morons. I just tend to send them on a nice tropical vacation to not on my channel. Gets home from stressful day at work, plays game to get mad. Yes. I, I, if 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 it works for you, I mean, wh whatever. But not my personal idea of enjoyableness. 
I wonder what speedrun categories this game will have, or does have, possibly. There is the five-day challenge, which is neat. Though it's not really speedrunning, that's like, you know, score run, I guess. It does make me a little sad that speedrunning is kind of like, not quite in with like, you know, high skill shoot 'em up players. Cause like, it's a very similar sort of thing, but just not quite enough for them to be, usually be at like GDQ and so on. Especially cause like, well, some shoot 'em ups do kind of reward slow tactics, unfortunately. Um, I, ha I hate when games let you boss milk. It's really boring. It's not usually intended, but it's just such a boring way to get high scores. Like in some games it, where you graze, um, it's why most good shoot 'em ups will have like an auto death timer. So that even if you don't hurt a boss, it will eventually die just so you can't like graze infinitely and get infinite points. Yeah, that's enough of those plorts. Let me see if I can get some new stuff from that one whatever thing. Oops. I was gonna need it was it was Fire Town back home for just a brief moment. Ah, oh, we're so close to the next thing. I want a slime trophy. It's just like Animal Crossing. We get we get a big trophy when we pay off our debt. I guess it's kind of sad that you didn't play Phoenix, right? Somehow put out of bounds. Oops. What do you mean, sad that I didn't play Phoenix, right? I... I'll probably play it eventually, but I have just so many games to play. I did enjoy what I did play of... I played a demo on mobile. I would... I'd probably get the 3DS version if I were to play. Yeah, it was a shame that the task block didn't happen this year. I think there was personal things going on, or... Though there should be... I mean, there's a lot of people in the task community, so I... It doesn't have to be Taskbot, you know? This has been kind of weird that they insist on. They kind of do... They try to do kind of the similar kind of thing and just one-up themselves. And I think that's kind of not the best way to go about it, honestly. Because that kind of ends up with a situation of, well, what do you do next? And it doesn't really let you focus on, let's do a cool thing. It just lets you be like, you just have to focus on what's even bigger than the last one. Which isn't, which is... You know, it's showmanship, but most speedruns don't have to worry about that, right? Like, a good Mega Man 4 speedrun is just, just a good Mega Man 4 speedrun. It doesn't it doesn't have to worry that it's not as fancy as the Mega Man 3 speedrun, you know? But, whatever. Didn't SGDQ run into technical difficulties? Oh, they had all kinds of issues this year. I don't want to sound too critical, but um, they... they you know, there was a bunch of stuff they had to cancel. Um, the 5 million bits thing, that was silly. Um, and the Metroid race was a train wreck for the th third time in a row. Slime Trophy 1. I have to see, what, where's my Slime Trophy? How did you get out? No. No. You get your booty in there. No, no, don't, don't, don't be on fire. What did I tell you about being on fire? Why are they on fire? They, they don't, they don't catch on fire when, in, in the other place. It's like they brung a bit of the fireplace back with them. Oh, great, and there's plorts all over the place. These guys would be the absolute worst to have in combination with the, uh, the tangle plorts. With the tangle slimes. Anyway, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh! There's the slime trophy! Hello, friend. It's gold. Oh, it's got a new buck on it. But th that's only slime trophy one. There's apparently more. Hmm. So there's an interesting thing with the slime... The, econ the economics of the, the slime things. The plorts. So whenever you sell a plort, the price actually goes down a bit. And whenever it takes a while for you to sell another plort, the price kind of goes up. So it encourages you to, to you to have diverse plorts or ultimately stockpile them and sell them when the price is high. But that kind of, that's more effort than I think most people bother going to.
I'm kind of sad you can't have like an indoor space that you decorate with like the, uh, the slime lamps. Hmm. I guess I should plant something. What am I low on? Odd onions are a pain. Not one of these. Oh, these are annoying. I guess I'm low on those. Oh, very low on those. Okay. Mint mango. Cute berry. I don't know what to do with you losers. I think I have a farm in here. <laughs> yeah, I think they could stand to just have a normal task block where they just show some really good task replays. It doesn't have to be, you know, Twitch chat on an SNES. Like, I think a lot of people are getting tired of the whole arbitrary code execution thing. Like, yes, you did a silly thing and it took things from another thing and it put it on a Nintendo. But, but that's really basically what you did last time, it's just, uh, Like, it was really cool the first time, but they kinda, uh, I just kinda wanna see cool runs. Like, there's some really cool tasks out there. I think the thing about boom slimes is they stop booming after they've been in a pen for a while. So... At first, these guys will be very agitated, but once I leave and come back, I think they'll be more chill. To be fair, you could just run Taskbot runs on YouTube. But I mean, to be even more fair, you could just run live, watch live speedruns on Twitch. Like... It's... Wait, did we have some frame drops? Oh, God damn it. Hold on. Let me drop that bitrate a bit. Mediacom, please. Mediacom, no. All right, bring it down again. Mediacom, please, why? Why you do this? Live speedrun Twitch is not going to have a live commentary. I mean, yeah, it does. Tons of people do commentary. I, there's actually very few speedrunners that really don't talk at all. Hmm. I think we're stable for now, but if it... I don't know. I have been streaming for... What? Well, I haven't been streaming. YouTube has a thing that tells you. Oh, there we go. An hour and a half. That's kind of a lot for a for a Tuesday. If I don't know how bad does it look for one thing. Oh, it's not AT and T. It's it's my internet. It's being stupid again. Oh, fun trick that I didn't know for a while. Um, you can douse the radiation from rad slimes with water. Which is not really how anything works, but hey, it's neat. I think you can also reduce the agitation of uh, boom slimes that way. But uh, like I said, I think if we go back here... Oh, you're having intertubes issues as well? They're not calm. Well, maybe it has to be like a day or something. Hold on, did some spill out? Aw, oh, crap! Well, it's actually not a huge deal if they spill out as long as there's no food. When there's food, actually I just plant some food. Actually, they can't eat that food, so it's fine. The quantum tree is really interesting. You have to, you have to shoot a fruit into the quantum tree for the fruit to exchange into this dimension. So they actually can't eat fruit from it. Maybe the quantum slimes can, I don't know. I'm just gonna sleep. Alright, I'm gonna see if that was temporary or not. If we're gonna have potato quality, I think I might call it a night before too long. Eh, eh, frick. Wait, maybe. 
Yeah, it's not quite stable. Let's play two. Why does it do this? Uh, this is why I... I don't think I could ever do, like, streaming as, like, my only thing, because this... This gets really infuriating. Okay, I think it's okay now. Did I sleep? Yes, I did, because it's ten... It's six. Why are you exploding? Calm down with the explosions! Look at all of this! Hold on, why is... What, what happened to my frames? Why? Whoa. Why is my frame rate Garbo? Hold on. 33% idle process. I. Oh. It's okay now. Yeah, I dropped the frame rate or the bit rate to two. Oh, you're still exploding! Cease! I I'm pretty sure eventually the boom slimes do calm the heck down. That or maybe I just made a huge mistake by cramming them all in one pen. Um, whatever. It's because of all the slimes. But the slimes were all here before. Like... There's, there's nothing unusual about today that would cause performance issues, that I would think. Come here. Hmm. Uh, where did these go? Those mint. Yes. I should probably make one for fruits and one for vegetables now that I think about it. I don't think I... No, I didn't do that, though. I almost did that. I'm actually very close to having done that. So while I'm thinking about that, I will do that. If I can. Oh. Just need to put the lemons in the other one and we'll actually be good. Uh, yeah, it's just this one. I really wish OBS could like detect that network is having issues and just, oops. And just be like, okay, I'm just gonna reduce your bitrate automatically. I just unlocked the plort door to the ancient ruins. What should I be doing next? Uh, just explore the ancient ruins, really. Um, I think you'll there'll be another slime key door, but um, you're pretty close to something pretty big. Oh, also you'll need to get um, you'll need to figure out the um, the quantum slimes on your way. The only way the Wi-Fi is screwing up is when Discord stops working. No, that'll do it. All right, so those are nicely organized. Oh, I forgot to show you. So, as part of that expensive like rewards thingy, you can change uh, the color of all your your crap. It's like let's make everything cobalt. So you can change your house, your gun, and your like buildings colors all together off oh, all separately rather get your booty back in there oh, they make such a mess this guy's i wonder if i should have like put these guys or put the mosaic ones with grab or the the grabby ones because then they would uh both of my annoyances would be in one Express yourself so long as expressing yourself is the seven logo on your stuff. I don't think the seven is actually on. Oh, I guess it is. I'm not really sure what the seven is supposed to even mean. Yeah, what's the next reward? Dang, these ranks go up pretty high. I'm guessing they at least go to 20, and it's been very expensive to get up so far. But it gives you something to do with your money, which I guess the game was kind of lacking after a point. 
I did stop getting money until those got added, so yeah, I guess it is justified. Oh man, cool spot. There was a cool spot game, and I heard it's actually not terrible. I'm not sure if it was like good, good, but like, I don't know, you can do things in it. Wait, oh, I was supposed to get, wait. What was I going to do? I was gonna, there was a Gordo. Which Gordo was it? Was it a mosaic? Or is it a... I think it was a mosaic. I completely got sidetracked there. Yeah, it's, it's a... There, there, so there was a natural mosaic uh, slime. But uh, I just never noticed it until now. Wait, there was an NES one too? Huh. I think I was only familiar with the Genesis one. I never had it myself. I fortunately never really had too many licensed games. I did have a bad... Um, extremely difficult um, Spider-Man game. I think it was my LGN actually. My only LGN game. That was back when I couldn't really tell the difference between a game just being bad and unfair and me being bad at games. But I'm pretty sure it was just a bad game. In retrospect. Ah. Oh, that was... I thought there was one that had, like, fallen through the universe. It's just pink. It's kind of weird that the pink slimes... I guess they gave some use to the pink slimes. Ooh! I guess they gave some use to the pink slimes with the factory update, because pink plorts are needed to build a lot of crap. But it was kind of funny that pink... Pink slimes are the... Am I still dropping frames? Oh my god, okay. We're probably gonna stop in maybe 10 minutes or so. Um, but yeah. Oh, what was I saying? Oh! Overlooks this place. Uh, what is this then? Uh, what was I saying? Ooh! Secret. Oh yeah, but they're, the pink slimes are kind of the, the mascot character, but they're the most useless for the most part, because their plorts are so cheap. And... Ooh, Master Pump! Last nine cycles. Okay, I was wondering if they would finally be an even better version of the pumps. So yeah, now I need the drill and the apiary. Oh yeah, I did have Aladdin for for... Genesis. That was that wasn't a bad license game though. That was a pretty good one. I never really had too many bad license games. Like I never got um, Superman for N64 or anything. Ooh, I bet that's another one of the advanced thingies. In fact, this probably this so this trail probably leads to all three of them, doesn't it? Oh, I bet that's one of them. I'm gonna say drill. Oh, berry warp depot. Oh. Okay. I don't think I can reach this. I never even noticed this up here before. Maybe you can't even see it from down there. Alright, what's this? Towering glass sculpture? Oh, cool! Well, the first GameCube games we got was a Quidditch game. I hope all these slimes don't get burned up, because it seems like a dangerous place to be right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, hello. Ow. <laughs> okay, that doesn't work. Ooh, pretty. Alright, there's gotta be more black things. More black treasure pods around somewhere, right? There's the, if there's a master pump, it's gotta be the other ones too. Alright, it's kind of hard to seek for specific colors when the world is like this. Oh, for. I almost walked off. Oh no, there's stars! Ah, oh, whatever. Is the sun up yet? Oh! You can't see the features of the sun, it's just a sphere. 
It could have a slime face, though. But as long as the slime face is exuding enough energy, you just see whiteness. One thing I like about Slime Rancher, you can kind of get up here in the crazy places, and the game is pretty fine with that in regards to... The jetpack can get you in a lot of kind of wonky places, and it's just fun. And there's nothing to really, like, try to stop you or anything. Ah! There's one. First... Ooh! Master Apiary! I knew it. I knew there was Smeekrits. Okay, I don't think there's anything this way. But there is another thing this way. I think that's just a blue, though. Murder Desert is your sum. Seven is just the, the weird level of exquisiteness that you've unlocked. It's weird. Um, wait, did I get up there? Yes, I did. Yeah, this is just a blue one, so this can't be the master whatever thing. I think it was the master drill that I don't have. Ooh! <laughs> a potted tactus. Okay. It has the face of that one Pokemon that murders people. How do I get... How do I get water to this area? It's like, it was a long way from the last thing. Well, I guess if I could fill those, I could probably reach here. Anyone know if there's like anything that you get for unlocking or for watering all of the buds? If not, I probably won't worry about it too much. Don't tempt me like that. I'm sure there's no way to get all the way up there. Well, thanks for the follow, Molly. What to where? Oh. Um. It feels like it has to be right around here because all the other ones were the uh, the drill. That's that's one I harvested, right? Yeah, it must be. Oh, it's fire happening. Oh no, just night music. Uh, maybe if I climb the ledges. There was one in here. I just read a thing. Right now there's nothing for watering all the buds, but maybe next update. Oh, is that like official information or just people just speculating? Uh, ugh. If I can find this last black sphere... Oh, not regen my stuff. I think we're pretty much done with uh, this area. We can find that. There we go. Wait, what the? I think it still considers me in in like a jumping action or something. There we go. The jetpack can be weird in uh, areas you're not supposed to be in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Speaking of, I don't think. I'm not sure anything's hidden here, because it just kind of feels like geometry they don't really intend you to be on, but you're still allowed on. Ah! Never mind. They do expect you to be that adventurous. Super Hydro Turret! Ooh. But that's not what I was looking for. There's lots of good stuff in this area, though. This is, this is pretty great. All we know for sure is there's no... Okay. Um, now that's suspicious. Maybe. Hmm. Uh, 
Oh, invisible walled. Wait, maybe. Oh, no, never mind. No invisible wall after all. I was gonna say, this game doesn't usually do invisible walls. Though I'm definitely not supposed to be up here because it still thinks I'm falling. Yeah, you're not supposed to be on that geometry. Um, where could this last one be? Here is the badly drawn made comic I did. Let me take a look at this. <laughs> Hold on, this is from Unplugged Comic. Let me put this into my potato OBS. Dum de dum. Why are you on fire? Cease being on fire! And then chasing it down the road. Accurate. I'm so tired of these slimes being on fire. I mean, just look at them. It's just rude. Original idea by Sun Gaming. <laughs> you got your wish, Sun Gaming. Mr. Rosens. Wait, what's this? Oh, there's more? What? Access denied. Oh, it's got an extra thing. This one's from Mr. Rosen, it's just me with my oddly threatening looking backpack and tabby slime and pink slime. <laughs> I see that aw yes emoji. By the way, if you get you get precious aw yes emoji if you join my Discord. There's the, the bird that goes aw yes. Ugh. It's so annoying that it doesn't uh it's just completely black when we uh, tab out. I guess I just have to explore all the upper geometries like this until I find that which I seek. So we found so much great stuff, so whatever else we find, it's obviously going to be worth it. I'm just not entirely sure where any of that crap would be. Salvo and slime. Of course, I'd read it. Any fan art or anything, I'm always interested to see. Um, whoa. Whoa. In fact, it reminds me. I kind of need to. I have some backlog fan art that I I post all my fan art to my website, but I uh, I haven't made a video showcasing. I have. I owe Brad like. I think I could make an entire video just on Rad's fan art, actually. <laughs> She's not in the chat tonight, I don't think, but, uh... Oh yeah, Salvo, the... Yeah, that is the slime boss from, um... Yoshi's Island. I just wasn't thinking of that at the time. I wonder if there's secrets down there. Alright. This could be a bad idea. This could be... Ah, yes! Very good idea, never mind. There it is, Master Drill! Master Cylinder! Alright, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Oh god. Um. Mommy. Alright, we're fine. Maybe this. No? Maybe this? Ooh, Sneakrit? Sneakrit, maybe? No, just, just environmental art. Okay, re regen. Now, the Master Drill is like nine, though, which is like three times as many as the other one. So I'm I'm okay with that as long as it's not like 
It's so expensive that it's not actually like a value savings or whatever I'm trying to say. Like as long as it costs less than three times, it'll be great. Okay, refill. Uh, I also think that you might doom yourself by getting down here. I'm not actually seeing a way back up. There's gotta be a way back up, right? Um, it's not like I have a super valuable inventory, but, oh wait, here we go. Here we go, here we go, we're fine. Maybe, possibly, I think. Yeah, we're good, we're good. All right, that was a little scary, but whatever. All right, let's go home. I'm gonna see what those things cost. And I think we got largely everything that there is in the glass desert. Like, it's probably a random couple, maybe, uh, things and treasure crackers. But we got the three master things. We got the, um, we got the super hydro turret, which seems really cool. We got, we got the glass shard thing, so those are cool. And we got the cactus. So I'm not really sure what else we would even be able to get here. Oh, we also got another... Maybe another warp depot could be here. We got a warp depot. There wasn't... Maybe another teleport? I'd like to draw properly so I get really, really nice things. People always suck at it. Well, you're not gonna... You, you get good just by doing things a lot. I mean, you want to see suck. Go back and watch some of my really old videos. I had no idea what I was doing. I still don't know any idea what I was doing, but I'm better at it. Somewhat. They're like fireworks. They're beautiful. It actually kind of reminds me of the pirate or the the. What were those called? The little the lost soul thingies in um, Quest for Glory Four. I forget what they called those. Oh, these things make light. Oh, wait, or is that just my lamp? That's just my lamp, never mind. Um, what was I gonna do? Um, uh, cram that in there. Cram these boys in their, in their thing. Make crap with your fashion statement. Oh, they're still exploding! Okay, this was probably my worst idea ever. Um, the explodey boys are definitely gonna have to have their own pen. Which is so sad because I think everything else can pretty much stand being in one pen. But the explodey boys are just so problematic. Tumblr would hate them. Murder pit. All right, let me put the booms. Freaking boom slimes. They're, they're the worst. They're my. I don't know which I hate more, the boom slimes or the tangle slimes, but they're both massive pains in the britches. It's funny because quantum slimes looked really hard to contain, but they they send out fake copies, so it looks like they've escaped, but they have not. Oh fuck! I just. surgery on 50 people at once and all of them try to kill you oh no my slimes your slimes somehow die even though one of my slimes murdered me i should have taken a, a brief break drive people to feel emotions with your crap exactly that that is the true meaning of art to make people feel from your garbage frames there we go i think i think the i think this the spinny ones they're the mosaic ones, probably. Um, 
have do have some performance issues. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Get back in. No! Oh shit. Fuck. Um, okay, I just have to incinerate you now. I'm, I'm sorry. You understand this. He, he knows. He knows what fate has befallen him. I can't have... I can't have you being this. Actually, you know what? You can go, you can go into the sea. Get in the sea. Got some real distance on him. Blunk. Yeah, I can't have Largos in my slime zoo. Sorry. And that is against the rules. Ah, oh, you. Ah, oh, fuck. There's still an explosion one in there. There's like exactly one. Shit. All right, get get your anuses in here. Oh wait, there was a way faster way to dispose of this guy, wasn't there? And into the ravine. All right. Get 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 get. See, this is why I don't have food in this area. Wait, actually, I do have food here now, so that's actually extra dangerous. Though I just have the food that they can't eat, so it's it's still safe. Right, I need to surgically remove the boom. They remind me. They make, they make kind of Pikmin-y sounds, don't they? Where is the boom? There was supposed to be an earth-shattering kaboom! Get your quantum anus back in there. I think the explosions that I'm seeing now... I think those are mostly... Wait, no, there's one boom slime. Unfortunately, mosaic slimes also make explosions. But I don't think they... Wait, maybe they do knock things around. Maybe that's why they're so problematic. Maybe we should keep mosaic slimes with the boom slimes. Whatever. I think they're... Ah, oh, fuck. Get back in. Okay. I think they're mostly contained now. Yeah, I think... I think they're all good. I think they're good. Alright. Oh, and our quantum lemon screw. Hold on. See, to get quantum lemons, you have to grab... I think it has to be a fruit specifically, too. Uh, you have to grab another fruit and send it into the tree. I think I tried with beets, and they actually did not work. So it, ha it can't be a veggie. Which is weird as heck, but whatever. The annoying thing about dying is that it advances time... Day, er, it advances time a, a day forward, so... If you have plants growing and stuff, it kind of wastes a cycle or so. Get mango. Oh, wait, I actually need... Uh, give me some of these back. Like I said, I need to send the cubeberries into the quantum lemons. Wait, what? Oh, it died! It died! It was just there! Son of a butt. Well, that's why I try not to plant my last seed, unless I'm super careful about it. Hey, Pariah. Um, are you? Yes, you are. Okay. I think you... Wait, can you eat fruits? Yes, you can. I aim for things that can eat at least two different things, and never only meat. Avocados, the, the, the practical alternative to adulthood. Oh yes. 
Unfortunately, we do not have avocados in this game. They're far too expensive. You know, we, we're just dealing with, you know, crystals everywhere. We obviously can't afford, you know, things like an avocado. Oh, they're so pretty! I need to make a bunch of different uh, mosaic largos. I'm so glad slimes don't starve. This game would be infuriating if slimes could starve. Like, that would be like a single feature that could like completely ruin this. Looney Tunes, watch everyone. You know what's fun about game facts, the guys, they say the dungeon is easy. Yeah, I, I actually don't use game facts too much anymore. I usually just search like a specific thing and I get a more specific answer. And I'm actually kind of surprised. I figured the game facts would like completely eat up all search engine optimization for like any kind of game guide, but I I managed to get in first with um with um um with a few games like Axiom Verge and uh Abyssrium, and I I just rank first on those games, and it's pretty cool. These guys have made a lot less plorts than I thought. They also eat... They have eaten the, the ash really fast. I think maybe... Are they shy? I don't think they're shy, are they? Hold on, let me look. Alright, I haven't seen the... I haven't read the, the descriptions of the new slimes. Mosaic Slime. Mosaic Slime gets its name for the glittering array of glass tiles that cover its body. The glass produces a similar anomaly in the desert itself, making the slime produce beautiful but quite dangerous. Oh, so it causes the flame anomaly. That makes sense. Rancher Risk. Mosaic Slime can be very dangerous for an unprepared rancher. Their glass tiles create a simmering effect in daylight that attracts other slimes to them. It's unknown why slimes exhibit this behavior exactly, but leading theorists indicate that sparkly things are super cool. Even more dangerous, the mosaic slime can produce glints in space around them. Ultra-hot solar anomalies that grow in intensity before drifting towards the ground and bursting into flames. Glints can be snuffed out with a splash of water, but the best way to reduce their appearance is to ensure your mosaic slimes are well-fed and not agitated. Oh, so I probably need... I think there's a reduce agitation item I can give them. Mosaic plorts... Oh, hold on. Mosaic plorts are discovered for the glass structure... For researching the glass structures within the glass desert. Samples of this glass turn brittle when taken from the far, far range. Yet interesting, mosaic plorts seem unaffected by this phenomenon. Almost certainly this glass is being studied because it's really pretty and not because it can cause devastating solar anomalies. What's a tangle slime got? Did I spend an hour in the dungeon that was no problem because it's a warp maze dungeon? Oh no, I hate those! Yeah, I even managed to get lost in Star... Er, Omega Ruby, even though it's super easy, but the, uh... Like the game is super easy overall, but I still got lost in the Wart Maze dungeon briefly. There's a really mean teleport puzzle at the very end. See, so yeah, I think there's like I still need to plant some stuff. Um, I think I need to put a drill and a pump in the desert to find the last two resources. Then I should have them all. Tangle slime. Though the tangle slime may look innocent with a, its wide smile and colorful flower atop its head, it's actually a fearsome predator with a big appetite for tasty meat. The tangle slime earned its name for the twisting vines it can grab, produce to grab things in the environment. It's unknown what caused the tangle slime to become such a fearsome predator in the barren wastes of the grass, glass desert. However, if the land once resembled the lush greener of the oasis within, perhaps the tangle slime evolved in a much different environment than the one you see today. Tangle slime can be handy on the ranch if they're not well fed at all. Can be, can be a handful on the ranch if they're not well fed at all times. Not only can tangled times tunnel their vines underground to snatch food and plorts from outside their corrals, flowers on their head can produce a noxious po pollen cloud that cause other slimes to get into sneezing fits. Huh. When slimes sneeze from the pollen, their agitation rapidly increases, causing more boom slime explosions, crystal slime spikes, and all around jumpings. Despite the troublesome nature of the slimes that create them, Tangle plorts have incredibly beneficial agricultural applications. 
fertilizers and growth formulas made from tangle plorts are used by farms all across the earth to gre greatly enhance crop production. It's speculated that unusually high nutrient count found within tangle plorts that now grow earth vegetables results in the tangle slime's incredible appetite for chickens. But that's super gruesome, so let's just ignore that. I rely on game facts for EO games, but not never use it for Pokemon. Ducks are frozen in time because you got the Slipedia. Ducks? What ducks? But yeah, these guys, they eat a lot of ash, and they only produced six plorts this time. I think... I think I have too many or something. Let me... Cut that number in about... Okay, they look happy now. I wonder what happens. Huh. So... Let's get something to shove into... Let's make some more ash for this thing. Bye, chicken. And boom, plorts. Ah, whatever. Wait, that's not working, is it? What do I want? What do I need then? Uh, give me some fruits or something. Oh, come on. The, there's this weird effect in this game where the fruits are like never actually grown when you need them to be. Like when you first visit an area, everything is dead. Uh, I'm sorry, rock slimes. So you're gonna become food. I think it required that many things to fill up the ash trough. At least there aren't warp dungeons and random portals. Yeah, that... Having random encounters and... Oh. I think it has to be a food product. Okay, hens work. Whoa, they eat so fast! Sheesh. Well, I'll worry about them later. It's not really a big deal. I think I just put too many in the, of them in there at once. <sighs> How does the stream look, by the way? It's it's well, only 1.5. It probably looked pretty crappy, right? I think I'm going to end right around here. I think I'm going to see what else I can get what I can make in the uh, thingy. And then I'll probably call it quits. Yeah, let's just buy all of these. The more the merrier. Taming bell. Whoa, 9,000. But he can make googly eyes. Fashion pod remover. Eh, sure, let's just spend all of our money and unlock everything. Thanks for the follow, Fidei. Uh, stream seemed pretty blocky, but viewable. Uh, yeah, it's... Bitrate is a lot lower. Let me... Let me see if this was intermittent. Let me drop frames, but I'm gonna jump back up. Okay, go up. Um, uh, no. Ugh. I hate this crap. Yeah, I, I, I can't raise the bit right now. Um, hmm. Master Apiary. Oh, Tangle Plorts are required. Master Pump Dervish. Mosaic. Okay, I can get those. That's not a big deal. Uh, advanced Cordo Snare. Less random results. Slimes and other items stick to for a short while. What? Learn more. Huh. So that's a practical thing, then. I don't know. 
excuse me. There we go. Calm the anger when you feral slimes. I don't really need that. Super hydro turrets. Silky sand. Uh, that's yeah, that's some stuff that's only in that one place. Yeah, it's probably Mediacom's fault again. Curios. So do you have to make one of these for each pair of googly eyes? Oh my god, what? Two royal jellies? Are you kidding? No way. Fashion pod remover. Those better be infinite or something. Because there's no way I can spend two royal jelly for each pair of googly eyes. That would be ridiculous. Ooh, Coco Slime Lamp. I like how the bottom one is so grumpy. Look how grumpy that cannon is. Well, some grinding required to get any of these, but uh, we got some good stuff today. That will haunt my nightmare, the undefined one. What do you mean? What, what, what links are you sharing? Um, I suppose I should put these in a refinery. Let's see if I can get a chat thing that has a transparent background. Is it too ugly? Also something hopefully with a bit, well, I guess I could change the text size myself. Oh yeah, I think Imager does that now. If, you, if you're too quick on the draw, it just gives you emptiness. Yeah, there's all these like dialogue things that I haven't read in the game because they were added after I played all these areas. I don't really want to advise, run through them right now. Highly advise you have a jetpack and a few upgrades before tackling what's ahead. Land is all broken and twisted, but there's plenty of feral slimes who won't see you coming before they blast you right in the sea. I really like the uh, general look of the game too. The I like these big forest, mushroomy forest areas. Wait, is that a feral? Or a, yeah, hunter. I should just make a hunter Gordo. All right, I'm gonna sign off here. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. The eyes follow your cursor. Oh, I've seen that one before, yeah. The Imgraft. Has anybody made the curi the, the, the the fashion pods in this game yet? Um, I'm wondering if you if you can like do stuff on infinite slimes or is it just for a single one? <sighs> well, Thanks for watching, everybody. That was a fun stream. Um, tomorrow, I'm thinking either LSD or Horizon Zero Dawn. I guess it just depends on which mood I'm in. Um, this was already kind of a chill stream, so maybe Horizon Zero Dawn tomorrow. But it's been a while since we played LSD, too. But, uh... Oh, chat wants LSD? Freedom Planet? I haven't really been playing that. I could play it at some point, but it wasn't really in the plans anytime soon. Yeah, it's been a while, so I think we'll I think we'll check out LSD because we played Horizon a couple times this weekend. See ya.
So yeah, come back tomorrow for LSD around 6... Um, 6 p.m. Central. Same time this stream started. I'll start... I'll make a stream event. Twitch has events now, so you can, like, schedule a stream just like YouTube lets you. So, that's pretty cool. Twitch had kind of caught up with some of the stuff I didn't like about it, so... I'm not too upset with having to deal with Twitch. I would still rather just have one platform. That was the one thing I really... The, the, the biggest reason I went with just YouTube is because I could just link a single thing and that was my live streams that was my that was my VODs that was everything but uh, ugh, whatever if you want to know why if you don't know why I'm on Twitch again or don't know why I'm complaining about this look at my YouTube it's my it's one of my last posted videos it's there's idiocy afoot it's unfortunate All right, I think these guys are finally chilled out don't they look like Skittles, though? Don't you just want to just, just sneak a little bite? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. The, 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 the mosaic ones especially look like really shiny gushers. Ow. They're so pretty, but so dangerous. Yeah, it's... Bleh. Anyway. Thanks for watching, everybody. Uh... Hopefully see you tomorrow. Wait, that's not what I... Oh, I... There we go.